In this video, I show you how to use templates in CapCut. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like. And let's go and jump straight into this guide. Here we are on CapCut, and it's important to note that this guide is going to work on all different types of devices. That includes computers and all mobile devices and anything which has the CapCut app on it, it's going to work. So the first thing we need to do is if we go and expand local, just like so, as you can see, we've got edit and then templates and it says templates will appear here. So you're probably wondering how do I go and get some templates appearing here? Well, let's get right into this. So what you need to do is just close off of CapCut just like so and you need to go and open up an internet browser. Because I'm using an iPhone, I'm just gonna use Safari in this case now. Then once you're on Safari, all you need to do is go and search CapCut templates. Here we go, I've now gone and searched CapCut templates just like so and I'm gonna go and press go and we'll go and see what the results are. Now as you can see, we get quite a few results from CapCut.net. This is because CapCut have their own sort of hashtag system which allows templates to be shared online. It's really cool. Let's go and tap on this top one here and go and see some of these awesome templates. So you can then go and scroll down until you go and see a template you like the look of. There are so many to go and take a look at. And I'll also show you another way of finding templates in just a moment. But if you want to go and preview what a template looks like, all you need to do is go and tap on it just like so. And then it's going to go and say, would you like to go and open in CapCut? If you want to press open, and then it's gonna go and allow you to go and preview it. As you can see here it is, you can go and see what it looks like. And then if you want to go and use it, go and press use template, and I'll show you what to do next. But I wanna quickly go and show you another way of going and finding templates. So another way you can go and find templates is by using TikTok. People often go and post templates, um, sort of edit the templates firstly on TikTok, and they also just share templates on TikTok. Um, so yeah, now if you haven't got TikTok, then what it is, it's basically a social media platform uh, where you could scroll through videos and yeah, go, you can go and get it from the app store and you can go and create a free account and then you can open it up and I'll show you what to do next. So I'm currently on TikTok and to go and search and find CapCut templates, you can just go and scroll for the For You page, but you can also go and tap on Friends just like so, and then go to the top right and tap on that search icon, um, which looks like a magnification glass. And then what you can do is go and search CapCut templates, and if there's sort of, sort of a specific template you'd like, just go and add it in like a retro template, just type in CapCut templates retro or something like that, then go and press search. Then there's gonna be a load of results you can go and check out, and also you can actually go and find pages on TikTok and accounts which purely post templates templates for you. So let's go and take a look at this uh, um, video here. As you can see, it's a template. But if you go and tap on their profile, this profile is dedicated to sharing templates, which is really cool. So you can go and scroll through and find one you'd like to go and use. And once you've found one you'd like to go and use, for example, this one here, then all you need to do is go and tap on this little message here saying CapCut, try this template. Tap on that there and you'll get this pop up here saying uh, use template in CapCut. So I'll press that there. Then it's gonna go and open up in CapCut just like so. And you can go and preview it again. And then you can go and tap on use template in the bottom right, just like so. And then it's gonna go and allow you to go and pick the videos which you want to go and use in this template. So I can just go and pick some of myself, for example, just a few random ones, uh, just like that. And then once you've selected all the five clips, you then press preview in the bottom right, and then it's gonna go and merge it all, and it's gonna go and show you what it's going to go and look like. And yeah, it's really cool. And if you're then finished with it, you can then just go and press export in the top right, and you can go and save it to your device, just like so. And it's gonna go and export it. Um, and then you can go and post it on TikTok, or just do whatever you want with it as well. And it's now ready to share, so you can go and press done in the top right, just like so, and then press back off this template. And then as you can see, this template is now appearing in my template section on my CapCut homepage. So essentially you need to go and start editing the template and then it's going to appear in a section. So yeah, that is how you can go and use templates in CapCut. If you guys found this useful, please go down below and consider leaving a like. Peace.